What is up, guys? Today I'm going to be talking about uh, how to stop Maya from crashing when you're animating. So this could be either from when you're selecting controls and moving controls around, when you're scrubbing the timeline, uh, when you're uh, moving uh, keys in the graph editor, um, or just in when you're playing back your scene and it crashes. Uh, so this should hopefully help reduce uh, the amount of crashing that's happening in those cases. Uh, this isn't really necessarily for crashing uh, in other cases, like when you're opening files or if you're essentially doing any other kind of um, procedure or uh, operation. Uh, this is purely for um, these kind of cases of when you're animating and manipulating uh, characters and animation in the scene. Um, so in all my experience of working with uh, artists uh, over six years, um, 95% of the time, uh, any crashes from animating can be solved by switching the evaluation mode to DG. Um, so in order to do that, we can just go up to Windows, Settings and Preferences, and Preferences. And then the left side underneath Categories, you can look at Settings, and then underneath Settings, look at Animation. Uh, so then you'll have this little um, evaluation mode set right here, and it's by default set to Parallel on all machines. Uh, and actually, before I go any further, um, make sure that uh, in order to make sure that your uh, your preferences are set and, and stay, it would be good to actually close any other Maya sessions that you have open. So if you have other Maya sessions open, go ahead and close those uh, or save and close those. And then um, then in your last Maya session, uh, set this from parallel to DG and hit save. And if you absolutely want to be perfectly sure that this is actually stuck and that it'll actually keep that uh, setting and the preferences, you should close your uh, existing Maya session and then restart Maya. But in this case, uh, in the sake of time, I'm not going to do that. But um, so basically, all you want to do is switch it from parallel to DG. Now, parallel is quicker. So by quicker, I mean uh, when you're uh, scrubbing the timeline or um, playing back your scene, it will be faster and you'll have more frames per second. Um, however, DG is typically more stable. Um, and it's generally more secure. So generally what happens is when artists are continually running into problems with um, scenes of crashing constantly or um, very often, then I generally tell them to switch it over to DG, uh, get through that shot, and then switch back to parallel um, when they don't have any more issues or when they move on to a different shot. So there's kind of a little flip-flop back and forth. So basically what happens is you'll want to um, swap back and forth between parallel and DG based on if whether or not you're crashing or not, um, or if you just want to be safe and, and sure you can keep it at DG. Now, this isn't necessarily going to fix anything for um, any other instances of crashing, like when you're opening up a file or when you're doing another operation. And we'll be doing more videos on how to actually resolve the crashing in those cases. And that'll be coming out later on. But for right now, this is purely for just animating and scrubbing and moving keys and controls. So I hope this helps you guys. And uh, hopefully this resolves your crashing. If not, let me know in the comments and I'll do my best to help you out.